I just made a bomb breakfast. I made myself like fried eggs with salsa and cheese and orange juice and it was so good. I'm so proud of myself. <laughs> I never make breakfast. Hey guys, it's Sydney and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hi, I'm Sydney and you should stick around and click that little red button. So today I am going to just kind of like give a reflection on my freshman year at college. Um, a few people asked for like a reflection kind of video. Um, I'm probably going to end up like spewing some advice at you guys, but I want to make a separate video of like freshman year like Q&A kind of thing. So if you have any questions on my freshman year, on freshman year of college in general, leave a comment below asking your question and that will be one of my upcoming videos. Um, you could also ask me on my Twitter. All my links are linked down below for all my social media, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, everything. Yeah. So if, again, you are new to my channel, I go to Arizona State University. I'm going to be a sophomore now. I just finished up my freshman year, obviously. So my freshman year was very, like, it was very, like, monumental. Okay, maybe that's a little over-exaggerated, but it was, like, amazing for me because I just really needed something different in my life and, like... It just was exactly what I needed. And so I am from Chicago, like one of the suburbs. But um, yeah, so I traveled all the way kind of like across the country just to go to school out here. And I live here pretty much permanently now. I just kind of like make trips back and forth because I still have family in Chicago. So um, but yeah, and it was probably one of the best decisions of my life, traveling all the way out here for school. So the reason why I just loved my freshman year so much was because I really kind of got to have a fresh start. And I don't know, like sometimes, sometimes you just need a fresh start, you know? If you watched my other like reflection video that I just posted recently. I'll link it down below and I'll put a link somewhere on here. Um, but I said like over summer, like the summer before my freshman year was kind of rough for me. I lost a lot of friends and I just, I was just so excited just to like start a new life. That sounds a little extreme, but I don't know how else to put it. I just really needed a fresh start and college is like the perfect time for that, you know? And I had like a super, super, super fresh start because no one from my high school or no one from any like surrounding high schools that like I knew of was going to ASU. Except for one person and she went to like this like town over, you know, you probably know who you are if you're watching this. What up girl? What up? <laughs> like really besides her there was like no one else from my high school or like anyone else around who was going to ASU so like like got, I got the freshest start of fresh starts you know I didn't know anyone but at the same time it kind of sucked because I didn't know anyone and um, like my dorms they weren't like the cool like dorm life dorm where you just keep your door open and people like pop in and all the time you know because my dorms were outside and so I still like I don't know anyone who lived on my floor still to this point freshman year is over and I never met like anyone on my floor because it was blazing hot outside no one's just gonna leave their door open and so the only people I knew for the first few weeks of school up until sorority recruitment were just like my roommates and I loved them it was so much fun and I miss you guys so much if you're watching this I love you but yeah, so I knew like zero people besides the three other people I lived with. And then with that being not knowing like anyone, it kind of made me nervous like, oh no, like did I make the right decision coming here? I don't know anyone. But then I went through recruitment. I became a part of Pi Fi. And I met some of like all of my bestest friends in there. And I met more people. I'm always like very like pro go Greek because 
joining Pi Phi, not only did I make best friends in my sorority, but I made best friends with people outside of my sorority. Like, you just meet so many people, and it's just like, it's so much fun. Like, for example, my bestest friend, Maddie. I know you're gonna watch this. Hey, girl. She's not even in my sorority, and actually we met in one of our classes, but that's another story. That's like, that's just gonna be a whole video dedicated to that. Go Greek, it's fun. By the way, if, now that I'm on the topic of going Greek, if you are attending ASU next fall, or you are already at ASU and you still wanna rush a sorority, I will leave the registration link down below because registration is now open for recruitment. So go Greek, register for recruitment, you will find your home. It's a beautiful thing. That was the crazy sorority girl in me right there. I'm like super extra thankful for just Greek life. Not only did I meet a ton of girlfriends, but I met like the most amazing guy friends ever and it's really just made me feel more at home, not being home. Because that was like one of my biggest fears, is not feeling at home in my new home. My candle is going crazy. It's literally gonna like, looks like it's about to light something on fire. What, what if like my tapestry just like <laughs> light on fire? But so yeah, that's kind of how like the beginning of my freshman year was. As for the rest of my freshman year, it was pretty like, it was pretty dope, you know? Like, by the end of first semester, I had friends, I wasn't scared of like not making friends, and I came back second semester after winter break, and you know, the fun times just, they just kept rolling. It's crazy like how much a person changes just their first year of college compared to like all four years of high school. Like I feel like and I touched on this in my um, one year on YouTube reflection video. Like I've changed so much and like I said in that, like I have ASU to thank for it and just like my journey of leaving home and coming like to Arizona for school and just like creating a new life for myself. Like it's changed me so much and I'm such a better and happier person. I feel more humble than I was a year ago. I feel happier than I was a year ago. I just, I feel amazing. Nothing can bring me down. Like, you know what I'm saying? I just, I really have like my freshman year to thank for that because you really do change when you're on your own, you know, living in the dorms, don't have your parents there for you to tell you what to do all the time. Like you have to make your own responsibilities, take care of yourself, balance social life, school, and sleep. And um, I think I really like got it down to a T when talking about social life, school, and sleep. Sometimes you just have to sacrifice, you know, a night hanging out with your friends for a night in the library because one thing I will say in this video that's advice related that I wanted to save for a separate video is always focus on your schoolwork. Social life will always be there, but you or your parents are paying so much money for your education Get your education like there's always gonna be another outing that you can go to you know it's not a big deal and that is what I really focused on all throughout my freshman year because you know freshman year everyone's just like yeah there's this going on let's do this and that and that and it's like I have two essays one project and five assignments to do I'd love to join you but my mom dad me is paying thousands thousands of dollars so I'm gonna be in the library if you need me you know when I was in that position a lot of the nights especially second semester second semester kicked my ass but I still made it on the Dean's list rock on go me high five <sighs> I feel like I touched on a lot I feel like I was very scatterbrained in this video um, I feel like I'm always scatterbrained in these like talking kind of videos and I'm really sorry for that. But like I said at the beginning, if you have any questions on my freshman year or on freshman year of college in general, please leave me a comment down below asking or ask me on my Twitter or comment on a photo on my Instagram, whatever 
source of social media you are using, ask away. And I will make another separate freshman year Q&A video. I have a lot of ideas for freshman year related videos, so yeah. Um, I hope you guys liked this video. I love you all so much. Thank you all for watching. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in my next video. I love you. Bye.